there guys welcome to your class today we have to talk about new vocabulary related to television vamos a hablar chicos de nuevo vocabulario relacionado con programas de televisión ok so can you identify those tv shows you have on your screen you have to complete with the news a documentary a drama and finally sports show so which one is the first ok good Perfect. We have the first picture, a documentary. The second is the news. The third picture is a drama. And finally, we have a sports show. Tenemos un show deportivo, un programa de deportes. Ok, good. But we have to practice with some other words. Vamos a hablar igual o practicar con otras palabras. Ok, so the first picture is the music show. En estos tipos de show musicales, por ejemplo, Yo Soy, ¿ok? En American, American Idol. We have the talk show. Tenemos un programa de talk show en donde pues hay muchas entrevistas. Many interviews. Then we have the cartoon, ¿ok? Cartoon, pues vienen a ser las caricaturas. The other TV show is the reality. The reality show, ¿ok? Los programas de reality, guys. Then we have the drama show. Tenemos programas de drama, suspenso, ¿ok? And the game show. Programas de concursos en donde participa mucha gente. We call those TV shows game shows. And then we have the soup opera. The soup opera is related to um, classic productions. ¿no? Acá se refiere a producciones clásicas de telenovelas, ¿no? Soup opera, telenovela. And the sitcom. A sitcom is a very common show in everywhere, en todos los lugares, pues una comedia. The series. For example, Game of Thrones. Ok, tenemos una serie. And finally, the entertainment show. El show de entretenimiento, pues que puede ser de concurso, bailables, tipo concierto, lo que sea, pues de entretenimiento. We're going to review all these words in order to remember the new vocabulary, guys. So let's start with the first A word, okay? Entertainment show. Entertainment show. News. News. Documentary. Documentary. Sports show. Sports show. Sitcom. Sitcom. Cartoon. Cartoon. Talk show. Talk show. Music show. Music show, soup opera, soup opera, reality show, reality show, game show, game show, drama show, drama show, and finally, serious, serious, okay? Good job, students. It's time to practice then, and we have some exercises. Tenemos algunos ejercicios, okay? So pay attention. What do you have to do here? You only have to complete You have to match the pictures with the correct names. Con los nombres correctos hay que relacionar cada picture. Ok, you have cartoon, documentary, drama, game show, news, reality show, sitcom, soap opera, talk show. Ok, the first one is the drama. Then we have letter G, sitcom. Letter F, the reality show. And then we continue with the news, las noticias, news. Letter A, cartoon, una caricatura, ok? Letter B, a documentary, and then we have to complete with the game show, right? Then we have letter I, talk show, and finally, soup opera, ok? Una telenovela o soup opera in English. In context, TV preferences. I watch a lot of TV. I really enjoy baseball. And I hope to get a big new TV soon. Jessica. I love soap operas. My favorite is Our Life. I like seeing my favorite actors. Lucas. I don't like reality shows at all. I love to watch the documentaries and game shows. Gustavo. I hardly ever watch TV. I prefer to listen to the radio. I hate to miss the news. Minhua. Okay, so according, guys, to the information that each character mentions, de acuerdo a cada información que los personajes mencionan, chicos, which one who doesn't watch TV very much, okay? The answer here is Minhua, okay? Yes, Minhua, because she said 
She hardly ever watch TV. Está usando pues un adverbio de frecuencia que muy difícilmente ve televisión. Ok, guys. So here you have a chart that I'm going to complete using some of your names. Voy a completar este cuadro, chicos, este tablero utilizando alguno de sus nombres. Bien. As an example. Como uno, unos ejemplos, pues, ¿no? In number one, you have to find someone who, encontraremos a alguien que, pues, en la número uno, number one, enjoys watching documentaries. Alguien que disfrute ver documentales. Ok, Esteban here, number two. Considers to watch TV news is good. Gabriel in this case, then we have here number three. Hopes to meet a famous actress or actor. Ok, in that case is Jimena. No one hates missing soap operas. Nadie odia perderse las telenovelas. And finally, I take my name, ok, because I think eh, most sitcoms are very funny. Bien, porque yo considero que eh, muchas sitcoms, muchas comedias, pues son divertidas. Ok, so I already complete this part. Mm -hmm. And then we have the final exercise. Tenemos el ejercicio final. Mm -hmm. You have to look at the pictures and try to answer using the new vocabulary. Okay, so in number one you have, does Carlos enjoy watching the news, probably, um, drama shows on TV? What do you think is the answer here? Okay, cartoons, very good. Cartoons on TV. Number two, do you want to watch the news this weekend? Number three, does Lorena like to guess the answers on game shows? Number four, Karina's mom dislikes reality shows? No, so operas, okay? And finally, number five, I don't understand why people like to watch reality shows, okay, guys? So good job, students, keep practicing, and see you next time. Mm -hmm. Remember that this exercise we already completed on class. Okay, hemos visto chicos fragmentos de videos en clase. Espero que lo recuerden porque es un refuerzo para ustedes de pues, eh, investigación sobre qué tipo de show estaríamos tratando. Okay? Now, thanks for your attention, guys. Keep practicing and goodbye.